So, and you're saying, I shouldn't have been there in the first place. Yeah, that's the, the first step is, I should have gone home after the party. I shouldn't even have been there. Right. But, you know, the night's, the night's going on. And never once was I giving him a lap dance, making out with him, sitting all over him. It's just, we're all together. We're in a group. Never once did we leave the public area, go to a bedroom, go to a bathroom. We're all in plain sight. And you have other girls with you. Yes. Okay. Why do you think no one else has stepped up? To defend. Let I want people you. to stand up and be accountable, but I don't want anyone to feel what I'm feeling. Yeah, I get it, because let me tell you, I've been here, yeah, I get it, and it's hard for people. It is, and it's no right or wrong to it. It's just hard, because it's heat. And why do they owe me right. that much? Right, Facts. What, from the night, would suggest that there was a lap dance of some kind? Now, this seems completely crazy to me. Mm-hmm that anybody says there was a lap dance involved because <laughs> there was no lap dance involved. But what I can think as to why someone would say that, there was a chair here, a couch, and another chair. Got it. It's all filled. Got it. So he's sitting in this chair, and there's an arm of the chair that goes up about here. Okay. And I'm sitting on the arm of the chair. So you come into the party, and you look, and you see me sitting on the chair in my head. This is innocent, you know? Like, we're all drinking, we're all chilling. There's no way it would look like a lap dance, but I could see why people would say, oh, they're getting cozy. Mm-hmm. Did you have your arm around him? No. Okay. But my legs were, were laying right over his. Got it. Okay. My butt was never sitting on him. But your legs were, so he but was... But my legs were dangling down, so I picked them up and I put them over. To, to, to onto his legs? Onto the bottom of his legs, yes. Onto the bottom of his mm -hmm. legs. There's stories that she was sitting on his lap. She was dangling in his, his crotch area. She, that is not the truth. But if you're looking for a story, I can understand why that would be the story. Right. So there wasn't any like intimate little chuckle, chuckle, giggle, giggle, you in his ear, him in your ear. I mean, as we all were just dancing and having fun, everyone at the party, so we're in this person's ear, this person, but never anything intimate. Never anything like. And he didn't make any moves on you throughout the night? No. He didn't try to take me to a room. He didn't try to, we were all, it was just an innocent time. But you could see how that could seem. And that's where I will take responsibility to where I can't be doing that. Right, right. Especially with even... the partner of a woman who considers you a sister and they already exactly. have. Because there's so much history involved. Yeah. I wasn't thinking right. Yeah. That's, I take full responsibility for that. Yeah, because the other difficult part was like, okay, Jordan left at 7 a.m., and you know it's hard for people to believe that mm -hmm. nothing happened. I, and I understand right. why. But in my life, in my world, it makes sense. The two nights before, I had been on kind of a partying binge where th that wasn't the first place I stayed till 6 in the morning. Right. There was always somebody there while I was there. Even so, up until the moment that you left? Even up until the moment that I left, there were people there. I finally look outside and I'm like, look, the sun's coming up. I need to take myself home. Right. And, you know, I tell everyone I'm leaving. I tell Tristan I'm leaving. And he's like, are you sure? You know, it's fine. You can, you can be safe here. And I'm like, you know what? I need to go. My car's outside. I had to drive outside. It's been waiting. Um... So this is where the story gets tricky because I feel like I can't point fingers. Yep, don't do it. And I can't say this, you did this or you did, because I allowed myself to be in that position. That part right there. I allowed myself to be there and 
I never was belligerently drunk to where I can't remember what happened. So you never had a blackout moment? No, I was never blacked out. But there was alcohol involved? There was alcohol involved. So how drunk were you? I was drunk. Okay. I was not tipsy. I was drunk. Right. But I was not beyond the point of recollection. I know where I was. But on the way out, he did kiss me. No. And what do you mean by kiss? It's just no passion, no nothing on the way out. He just kissed me and and like a tongue kiss, like a peck on the lips, peck on the like a No, it it was like a kiss on the lips, but no tongue kiss, no making out. Got it. Nothing. And I don't think that he's wrong either because I allowed myself to be in that position. And when alcohol's involved, people make, you know, dumb moves or people get caught up in the moment or who knows? Right. Were you shocked? I didn't know how to feel. I was like, that didn't just happen. Because, you know, I was leaving already, so I walked out immediately after. And I got in the car and... I was like, no, that didn't happen. And so you left immediately. Mm -hmm. Did you say it? Did you say anything to him? Like what? I was just like, I need to go. I was in shock. I was more so like, did this really? You know, I don't. I was like, hmm. Let me just pretend like that didn't happen. All right. Did you have any understanding, possibly, of why he would do that, or? I'm there until the sun's coming up. <laughs> right. So he's like, he's like, right. you know, maybe let me just, let me just shoot so, my shot. So you went home and what happened next? I went home. I had talked to Kylie and, and Chloe in the morning and I told them I was there. And I had talked to Chloe and she, you know, asked me what was going on. Is everything fine? And in my head of trying to forget that part of the story, I was just like, you know, no, he was, he was chilling. Everything was okay. Like there were girls there, but he wasn't, you know, all over the girls. What exactly were you not honest about? I was 